More than a week after Pennsylvania's primary, there's finally a winner for the Democratic nomination for state auditor general. Pittsburgh controller Michael Lamb conceded the race to former Philadelphia deputy mayor Nina Ahmad. Political editor John Delano explains why it took so long to find out who won. Some elections are so close that it takes every vote counted before we know a winner. And we had that in some races. But we also had a failure in planning to count all the mail-in ballots in certain counties, especially in Philadelphia. So why the slow vote count in Philadelphia? The Board of Elections took a pause uh, to uh, make sure that people had not voted both in person and by mail. That's one reason why it took 10 days to have enough results in for Michael Lamb to concede that Nina Ahmed won the Democratic nomination as State Auditor General. And believe it or not, we still don't have all the results in. I think they had about maybe 60,000 votes left to count. Allegheny County had as many mail-in ballots as Philadelphia, but got their votes counted the day after the election. Why? Because they had eight high-speed vote scanners while Philadelphia only had one. David Thornburg heads a Philadelphia watchdog think tank. In contrast to Allegheny County, I think this has been more of a manual process because they didn't have the, uh, the required or the, uh, the necessary equipment. Of course, even in Allegheny County, there were delays. State Representative Michael Puskarek only just learned he has won the Republican nomination by 178 votes. Uh, moving forward, we're going to have to take a look at some of the reforms that we put in place, see how they were implemented, and uh, really try to give the people a, a more predictable uh, system moving forward. John Delano, KDKA News.